I'm sorry, Lieutenant. You can be sure that Jane will be with you in a few moments. That's all right, ma'am. We're used to it. to the Dean's List. Tonight's feature presentation is called Totally Killer 2023. I've been seeing it all over my timeline. I said, I gotta check that out. And tonight is the perfect night. Let's get it, y'all. 35 years ago, three girls were found brutally murdered. Tiffany Clark was found butchered in her family garage. Damn. Stabbed 16. 16 year old Marissa Song was killed Ooh. two days later. Nothing. 16 year old Heather Hernandez was stabbed 16 times every Halloween. People still dress up as the murderer. Yeah, people rocking the mask. To my left, the home of Tiffany Clark, the sweet 16 killer's first victim. We should pick a band where I didn't know the lead singer. Eddie Royal <laughs> was such a jerk in high school. Well, you, you know. Amy, you're going to borrow my things. At least take care of them. This is vintage. I didn't leave it there. I was about to put it on. Oh, my God. Dad, what are you wearing? <laughs> Yo. I'm Zac Efron. But you know, back in the day, I used to be jacked just like him. Oh, I can't go to a concert because your friends were murdered 35 years ago. Mm. Okay. I would never have spoke to my mother like that. Well, yeah. <laughs> so I wish you guys would just get over it. Mm. Can't get over something like that. No. You know, when you sit in the back like I'm an Uber driver, it kind of hurts my feelings. <laughs> Please. Yeah, I texted her we're here. Why didn't you just knock? No, Dad. It's so rude. <laughs> Sorry, I'm a bit on edge. Trick or treating by yourself? Oh shit. Uh oh. Oh, no. oh all right. About being murdered since I was 16. She's trying to handle herself a little something. Ooh. Oh shit. Uh. Mom's putting up a little fight. <laughs> Ain't me for real. Oh shit! Come on, mom. Ooh, we got him. Ooh. Oh. Mom's put up a fight though. I ain't gonna front. Totally kill him. I with the count. Sweet sixteen killer. Has returned. Oh you really think you can do it? I think I'm close. You at least told your mom you're using her designs? No. Why is it set to October 27, 1987? Because that's the day that the first murder happened. Was mom friends with Christian Massage? Sheriff Lim said they texted. Then why would she text him? Because she wanted to help find the killer. The cops gave up a long time ago. And he had a crush on your mom. Her and I were still friends then. We didn't get together until much later when we got home from college. Now do me a favor, stop listening to Chris Dumasage. Hi. Chris. <laughs> we were just friends. She wanted to help find the killer. My mom her whole life, and I can't let him keep getting away. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Yo, he just came out of nowhere. Oh, shit. Wow. Uh, oh, shit. <laughs> hey, I'm looking for Pam Miller. Do you know her? Oh, uh, yeah, everyone knows Pam. 
Different back in the day. Okay, you cancel it. Maybe you should fuck off and die. <laughs> Hi, is Lauren Creston in here? Mm. Oh Please God. tell me you've seen Back to the Future. Of course. Oh, thank God. Thirty-five years from now, your daughter built a time machine based off of plans from a notebook. Your notebook. You catch the killer so he can't kill my mom because. Because you killed me. Because you killed my mom mm. in the future. And there you go. Time machine. When the killer attacked me and stabbed the knife into that panel, it did all of a sudden. It must have needed an extra metal conductor. Yeah. 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 Hey, you're taking this one really well, by the way. <laughs> so trying to invent time travel without considering the possibility that people from the future will need your help. How much do you know about quantum mechanics? I saw it in Endgame, but I didn't really understand it. <laughs> Kara, where's Jamie? Have you found her yet? No, not yet. What are you doing? We're taking notes for a new episode. <laughs> you know, Mr. Cubes, I know where Jamie is. She, he's my time machine. I, um, I made a time machine for the science fair. God, she's as weird as her mom. Jamie's meant to be. I have several follow-up questions. First question: <laughs> There's a dress code. What? No, there isn't. See, yeah, there is. No nerd jewelry. It's a replica of the first microchip commemorating the dawn of personal. Yo, shut up, Dory! <laughs> That's play cues? Oh my god. It's my dad! <laughs> yeah. hey, hey, no pictures, douche massage. Just be everywhere. You're trying to get Tim Brown for another one, I'll break Do me a favor. Dang. <laughs> Come on, let's go. <laughs> Damn. How did you do that? My mom taught me self defense. Yeah. Yeah, he's not acting like an idiot. Oh. oh, shit. Ooh. Damn. you know that she was in danger? I'm psychic. You're all in danger. But a couple of days ago, I said Tiffany was murdered in her garage. She was killed on her parents' waterbed. That's a basic detail. How can I forget that? Mm-hmm. The Mandela effect. She was changing. There she is! That's her! Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, my God! Jamie's back in 1987. We're here! Fuck. What is this? My parents' condo! No, this is not a condo! <laughs> it's not woods. Oh, oh my god! I forgot to bring vodka. <laughs> what? I thought it was just gonna be us four. What is the big deal? Did you just want to let out this weekend? <laughs> this is happening. This is happening. We are all here. And the murder cabin. Murder cabin! <laughs> 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 wow. That's crazy. She ain't waking up. Yes. Oh. She out. Damn. She bumped up her back and in. Mm. Ooh. Strike. Damn, you ain't doing nothing. Ooh. Mm. Oh, jump him, y'all. Damn. Donkey kicked him. Shit. Wow. You're weaving. Damn. Got a real problem here. Awesome. Here you go. What's this? You have his DNA. <laughs> What's that? 
Yeah. You know, it's, it's like, 87. We ain't that uh, advanced yet. This is fire up the old worldwide DMA database. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now let's get to you. Yeah. Who else knew you kids were going to that cabin? That's you know fucked what? up. Right. Hey, hey, too horny, too soon. <laughs> Whatever you want, just please leave the thundercats. <laughs> he said, please leave the thundercats. The graphics are amazing. When you kill someone, they explode into pink mist. <laughs> Trust us. It's a rape alarm. It's insanely loud. And if you get scared... <laughs> <laughs> oh, she did. <laughs> what if he slits your throat before she has a chance to press the rape button? What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Oh my god. I saw Marissa. And the killer was following her. Huh. We need to get Jamie out of there. Yes, I'm very aware. He just caught a new memory. Do something like that. Do you just think that I'm some sort of monster? It doesn't matter now, right? No, you're not. Oh, shit. Damn. He's from the future. Mm. his mask. That's a dog. You killed him. Wow. There's no adult dog anymore. Hey, I'm here. Keep rolling. There appears to be some sort of foot, Jason. A young woman just gave me a warrant. Oh, shit. Kill me on live TV. <laughs> Oh shit. Oh. Uh oh. Damn. Oh shit. Oh. Wow. Okay, okay, my people, that was totally killer. 2023, and that shit was fire. I really enjoyed that. That shit was like Back to the Future meets Scream because they added the who done it factor. You didn't know who the killer was gonna be. The entire cast was dope. The comedy was on point. The shit had me rolling at times. I really liked that scene in the beginning when the killer came after her moms. 
You didn't think it, but her mom was getting busy. She was throwing hands. She was doing monkey flips. She ran, grabbed the burner. She was hitting back. But the killer wound up getting the best of her. She went out like a G, though. The kill scenes was kind of basic, but effective. Because he was stabbed the person 16 times, and that shit was brutal. Shit, I was feeling it for them at times. But the movie was dope. The shit was fire. I enjoy everything about it. And it definitely makes the Dean's List. So, like, share, and subscribe. Hit the bell on the side. Make sure you don't miss out on the new shows coming out from your guy. I don't know what I'm going to watch, but I guarantee you, it'll be something crappy from the 80s. Or a more up-to-date joint like this. Peace, y'all.